In today's video, we unbox the 2009 Ram of Acheron Army Set for Confrontation Age of Ragnarok. Hey everybody, this is Lee from SkirmishWarGames.com. And as we mentioned in our last video, today we're going to go ahead and take a look at the Ram Army Box for Confrontation Age of Ragnarok. Confrontation, as we mentioned last time, was sort of a fantasy medieval uh, wargaming system produced by a company called Rackham out of France. And uh, they ran from about 1997 up through about 2010. And Age of Ragnarok was a later incarnation of their confrontation um, wargaming system that kind of focused on pre-painted plastics as opposed to the unpainted metals that they had had in, in earlier versions of the game. So this particular set is the Barony of Acheron. Acheron being, I think, a river in Hades in Greek mythology. And they're sort of the undead army. And uh, this is a really a very nice set. So unlike the Wolfen set, which came out about a year later than this, um, these guys are all fully painted. So let's take a closer look at what we got here. So in terms of pre-painted miniatures, these are really nicely done. And because they're generic undead, I could see these being used for a lot of different wargaming systems. Uh, you also get dice, uh, range ruler, uh, unit cards, and then And this is kind of funny. So you get the uh, obligatory paper map, which is fine. I'm not a big fan of paper maps, but it's better than nothing. And then they give you basic rule sets. But they must have thought it was cheaper to include all the different languages rather than try to separate them out by country. So you get an English version. Looks like you also get a German, French, and Italian version. And I don't know what else. Same with these little um, kind of cheat sheets here. So they just packed them all in the same box. So if anybody needs a basic rule set for Confrontation Age of Ragnarok in Italian, I can set you up. Okay, so let's take a closer look at some of the minis. Okay, so this is apparently a 2,000 point army with the totem of the ram. So I'll tell you a story about these gargoyles. When I got this box set, I ordered it off of eBay and it was in pretty good shape. Most of the miniatures were fine. But these gargoyles, they're so fragile. Um, the wings and the arms are pretty much all over the place. I'll show you a picture. It's like they had flown through a wind turbine or something. So it took a lot of work to kind of glue and pin these guys back together. And I'm still sort of afraid if I even look at them funny, they're just going to explode like a coiled spring and there's going to be pieces everywhere. Some designers said, wow, this is going to be really cool. And then some poor engineer has to figure out how to uh, produce and, and box these things up. Okay, so the backbone of the undead army is apparently the undead thralls. That's these guys. That's your basic skeletons. Okay, so here's some of the very, here's the skull warriors. I guess these are kind of like the leaders of the undead thralls. So there's the necromancer skull, the abysmal skull, the toxic skull, and the undying skull. And then all those guys are led by the great skull. He's kind of the grand poobah of the whole army. And then he is supported by... The Black Paladins, which are kind of the elite troops. So that's pretty much what you get. You get about 16 of these skeletons. You get four Black Paladins. You get four Skull Warriors. It's these guys. And then you get the Great Skull. And then these guys, the Gargoyles. And again, I commend them on the design work. The miniatures are beautiful, but man, those are fragile. And I think sometimes with these plastics, I think as they get older, they get more brittle. But when they arrived, it was basically just wings and legs and bodies and had to be pieced back together like Frankenstein. And then, of course, you also get some terrain pieces. These are pretty much exactly what you get from the um, Wolfen starter set. But I guess if you get enough of the starter sets, then, you know, you got plenty of walls to work with. Okay, as I showed you earlier, this um, Ram Armory box does include a really basic set of the Confrontation Age of Ragnarok rules, but in multiple languages. And then um, you also get sort of a little rundown of the units in the army, again, in multiple languages. So that's basically your introductory rules. These were not included in this particular box set. Um, this is the full rules of Confrontation Age of Ragnarok, available separately. And then the Ram Army Book. And um, so this kind of runs down through the fluff of this particular army and the different houses in the barony of Archeron and kind of explains the history and then um, some of the special units and things like that. But one thing I wanted to show you, here is a picture of um, 
undead centaurs. And I'm not sure if those are metals or those are plastics. And the reason why is the rumor mill, I was talking to a guy and he said, oh yeah, you know, um, these undead centaurs were produced actually in plastic. And there is supposedly somewhere either in China or in the US or somewhere a shipping container that was shipped um, that is kind of in limbo that has a lot of these and, and other um, Age of Ragnarok units. And the rumor was that some big online retailer was trying to get a hold of that shipping container. Now I can't confirm or deny that, it's just kind of fun, but they said, yeah, these units, there's photographs of them, but uh, you know, maybe someday, someday those will turn up. Yeah, neat little book and you can tell they put a lot of design. So here's ghouls, I don't have those in, in here. There are some units that are missing. So there's the gargoyles. Wampiers. This is a case where, you know, maybe some uh, horror clicks or um, Pathfinder minis could be swapped in for the vampires, you know, if you're missing some units. This was only a couple of bucks online, so probably worth picking up if you have any interest in this um, rule system at all. Well, we hope you enjoyed this look at the Confrontation Age of Ragnarok Ram Army Box. 2,000 army points, battle ready, the Legion of the Damned ready to take the field and fight against the alchemists the Temple Army, the Lions, the Wolfen, and anybody else who stands in their way. So hopefully we'll be test driving these rules here in the near future, and you can see how the uh, Legion of the Dam fares against the living. Well, thank you very much for watching. If you like our content, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, give us a big thumbs up, and or visit us online at skirmishwargames.com.